Hello and welcome to another freaking fashion um freaking show thing that I do. Not sure I do it, but I do. Especially for the bigger one. So oh. today we have the brand new Nicktoon, Welcome to V Wayne, which uh, I believe I brought up a few vlog. I knew it was show and it was coming and I knew I'm going to totally film because we always find no. But I had no idea going on the day that I did because no one don't no nope, I didn't see anything online about it until the day about the airing at recording time. But then in the glowing sunny town, y'all vote. To be fair, I don't get going for a whole lot recently. <laughs> you know, it only came out just last ten. So maybe it's my fault, but fair I can't anything about it. So when people start talking about it. But hey, I'm here to talk about it. But rain happened that great so far, gee, I wonder why, but hopefully it can improve. You know, we had that fun job standard, you know. Um but yeah, um go so, this started out with a mini skinny grammar that the comic that I ever watched because I heard this skinny you know, picked up, so I figured I'll wait for that. Maybe I could I could watch that to compare and contrast, but oh well. So, ran into two times. Okay, go. Go. <clears throat> um, this thing got the show about 22 minute episode for average. And then based off the first episode, Ragged Shine Sleepy Head. Uh, when I go into TV, I definitely love Fawn Fair. Then I get. I remember the sound about the book. Um, this can't keep that name of these stuff. Got Twitter map average, which uh, definitely different to Glowing and Turn Go Show very slightly more comedy based. This is definitely, we can, it's definitely different. Yeah, what's the new thing? Alright, go up to the we have a guy named um, Anthony, I believe. Oh, I, I have a Wikipedia page up. Um, yep, Anthony, who was one battle to great, by the way, um, which I didn't realize until I have it through the episode. Um, moving up the Game Boy. And uh, he moved into a compartment building called B Wayne where a bunch of what of weird and creepy stuff kinda happened and there's a mystery we're going at that he must call for hearing especially if a mini cook man of the episode and he sang along with the, the two friends who are twins. So pick on some of that description you can kinda see the inspiration here. Um um yeah, this could definitely take an attempt to do a I wouldn't I'm not gonna call it a ripoff or anything, but definitely seen it go little fire by Gravity Falls and other shows of that type. There are shows that are half comedy, half mystery, drama ish, that, you know, which people seem to be liking. You know, just stuff that will restore to it. That's not like, you know, like I'm talking about Femmond or anything like that. And I'll give them the credit for actually do, doing something like that. They definitely stuff that shake up formula. Blackhouse did the recently that book and be pushed to not do this because it was basically the same stuff. It's okay, it's like, you know, it's the same. Um, this thing definitely looks different. For Nick, anyway. So, my first impression of it is that, I, mean, I kinda like it. I, I will say a problem, but I can see the game get been better, and I'm really interested to see where it's gonna go from here. I guess my problem is that it does remind me of other shows a little too much, including Gravity Fog. I mean, yeah, between going twin. I mean, even if they're last name Timber or something we're fine. Again, not calling rip off or anything like that. I'm just I don't know, I have like having to come. <laughs> Got my, you know, hand uh Yeah. Anyway, um you know, it's got um and I you know, it got some flares over shows and not I draft out fine, but a little too fun for it compared to other shows of that type. It works fine. It feels still contrary, but I can see that getting better. Um, and again, that's a big critical moment. There are a few other things familiar with, but the main dynamic is more familiar for a show like this in general, not just. In fact, it's not that a great song, that I would say that with female characters, one more kitchen, mystery rather than the male one. Um, and get a cover straight man to the you know, straight man got the female friend who was a little. Um, you, you, you know, she. she to be fair, the male friend, he and Zane and Ollie and Caroline, Caroline, whatever, is the female one. Um, Ollie is the one that's more jokey and, you know, kind of silly. So I guess he takes turn off the female one who took him to be more silly, sort of, but I guess shouldn't call him kind of the, the mystery of it, you know. But um, I will have to say that most of it does work. Particularly for the humor, which was actually pretty good. You know, I it definitely gave me a quarter of a long time of humor. You know, it's my kind of humor to guy like, but 
sarcastic kind of humor, you know, the pretty amusing plot with the kids. I like the character interaction, particularly. I like Prime against Funny Clown. Like, I thought he could be annoying, but he's really funny. I feel like definitely a good example of a friend character like this. Kind of like Boone, like, you know, more of a Boone than, uh, like, a Howard, you know. So, you know, um, um, I find the mystery element is, I feel like what could drive drown show now for a couple of what being a little too good to skin more, and I feel like that element of Gawkle kind of skin more. Yeah, but, I mean, we even have the, um, the ending sort of thing going, ooh, the mystery continue, we actually are not quite done yet. But, I kind of like that. I really like some creativity in terms of what's going on in this flight, this big pump building way, and, um, there's some fun stuff going on here and that, and I'll, I'll say I feel like decent enough. I even, I like the library that they have, the secret library, not the one with Kofi. Um, <laughs> um, you know, and, you know, and I, the characters I like, you know, they are kind of stereotyped, but I feel like really entertaining. You know, and uh, there's a few minor points here and there, and it's something that interesting. And, um, yeah, it, I don't know. I, it's a little show I can't really describe how they get themed really a little bit. There's a certain charm to it, I feel like. May not get me to gal, but I'm gonna make it. It could, I at least will take this over something like Bunny King, but definitely they're taking from our show, but from creating our show, we're getting more, more play than this. And I feel like, you know, definitely, it's definitely worth what it is. Again, that it bogged down by reminding too much of other things that I think are better, like Grand Fall, and particularly that, and probably other shows. And, you know, it's not too deep in your story, but you know. Um, <laughs> you know, take what's going on for the first episode, for 22 minute episode, um, I feel like this is going to next moment to go to, too. I feel like round this thing out, like looking with Folly and Skin and Wind, which I like. But then, like, I kind of like where they sort of like twin, you know, yeah, they are, I think. Um, I feel like we're, they, they work surprisingly well. I feel like they're getting better than what you might think. So, yeah, for the first episode, it has got some comedy humor and it's got the mystery element of it. Even though I got to care about telling the best, and it does have elements that remind you of a show, particularly at fault, but not calling Rebuff to gain that familiarity. You know, but I just call it Dick Hunter Rebuff. I don't know how well I checked out yet, cause, you know. But, you know, it's one of those we'll see where it goes. They're starting to think up the bomb form, because of course they do. Um, and hopefully soon I'll have to get around to watching it. I have to go look at another show where I'm like, I don't care about watching more. I'm going to watch some more Hotel for me, but and I just think, eh. I feel like White Claw was enough. It's fine, but I don't think I need to watch more of it. This one I definitely will watch at least the rest of the bomb and see where it goes. To be completely honest, not a whole lot much to care about this one. It's like, it's not, the a lot of interesting are kind of squarish, or I don't have a lot to care about. You know, it's like, oh, the play can plot go, interesting, we'll see where it goes, it's more of a, I don't know, it's more of a pilot that I can't judge too much, because I have no idea where we're going to take this, wherever it will go full on, just trying to be like, I'll go wherever it, you know, okay, after, like, the pilot, we're all get cooled down on, it definitely had a lot, but there was a bit before we started building, you know, but things are, they not take too long to get to getting it up, so that's all, so, it's more of a, We'll see, you know, we'll see what goes. I think we're all on the pilot you can do it for a pilot for these, you know, I've done its job. And it's just a pilot, you know, which do for you. And I do find it strange we start off with him having how having been in the way for a few weeks already. But I think it's a way of starting to stick out in the um it you know, it's a pilot, so it's like it's not like for all the rest of it could be totally different. It's going to be more introduction or like the day of rock game here. But if it is, it'll still be one more entertaining thing I make. Yeah. <laughs> you know. Uh, I think each of you know it's not about equally. Believe it or not, I think Cartero could keep going. Cartero got more shows that people seem to like than Nick. One, one really good show on Nick and gonna make it better. Nor one bad show or two. Cartero gonna make it worse. I think we're all kind of equally cool. Well, but lucky, I think the show could definitely give things over Nick Favor. Nick Favor. And um, Disney got the tail coming. Which will even have for the Pictures Vlog back August 12th. That is in like two weeks. Next Saturday. So I, I'm looking forward to that. 
absolutely be good. I like what I've seen, everything I've seen so far. So, yeah, that's welcome to the lane. Wow, for a first event vlog, I'm sure I didn't have a lot to say. But overall, I do enjoy this, yeah, for what it is. And I do want to know where it's going to go from here, because I do hope it gets better, because I don't want it to have to get, you know, it's good, but it might be so much other things, but I think they're better. That's the big thing for the pilot. Like, it's good, but I'm like, it reminded me of other things I feel like are better. So I'm like, well, I could get out of it, but I could get out of some of those shit. We'll see. You know, can Nick do her own take on something like this? It's interesting. I'd rather have that than somebody else does that they have, you know? So, overall, it isn't working for me, but we'll see. I have no idea what people are going to think based off of this episode. Um, people seem to like the mini community, so, we'll see. So, yeah, so that's all I got. Tomorrow we have the Ben Nero vlog, and that for the Pesha vlog, it should be that tail. So, woohoo. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Sorry, we're going to watch this game, but it's not a lot I could say. I mean, at least for me, it'll probably, five people could probably go on further about it, about it. But, going purely at the final, it's not a lot to say. And I like to go off what web people I could have watched in the year, but going off that. But, this was when the day was here, and this is all people had to go off of on the air, and go back to what I would go with, instead of, you know, anything else, so. So, we'll see where it goes, but I do like it more than some of the other shows, and just, you know, so far, and, you know, the cloudy, broken hotel, you know, they're fine, but nothing I really want to watch again. Uh, but for sure, I'm just, I'm like, interested to hear where it's going, so hopefully when a few days I can watch some of the other episodes, you know, so. We shall see. By the way, um, Fairy Outfit basically ended tonight. They gave us history and we locked up between 10 and they had yet to air. It had not gotten renewed, and from my hear, they don't actually end it because they didn't bet things to really end around there. Yeah. So, yeah. So, I don't have a lot to say there. So, I shall see you tomorrow for Pen Hero. Goodbye.